Let us understand the intelligence behind curator and absent integration to detect exploited vulnerabilities that do not have a public CVE but have been found by AppScan. So I have a search here that I'm uh, I'm looking for all the vulnerabilities on that vulnerable machine that we exploited in the previous video and all these vulnerabilities were actually found by AppScan and I have pivoted on the instances. But notice that when I hover over the SQL injection which is the one that we exploited before it, it's also telling me that it knows which specific URLs, where are the fields that are vulnerable. Uh, so this is actually very nice because you don't want this to fire on any SQL attempt going into any field on that app. We just want it to fire on the ones that are actually vulnerable. Otherwise, it will be prone to false positives. And the same thing happens with, you know, all the vulnerabilities that do have, you know, a, a, a URL that helps curator identifies which are the entities that are actually vulnerable. It's very nice. And if we go into the details of the, for example, the SQL injection, notice that there's no CVE. Okay, it's not available, obviously, and it's expected because this is not a public vulnerability. This is a custom application. But there is an X-Force Exchange number. And if we actually click on it, we are taken to the X-Force Exchange, which explains, you know, what how a curator you know, relates to this or, or put a, a category on this particular type of, uh, of exploits. And the same thing with every one of the other ones. They do have an X4 exchange number. So let's go into the offenses and try to understand better, you know, how this magic happened. So this is the, the, the offense that we are interested in the detection of uh, an exploited vulnerability. So let's uh, dive into it. We see that has uh, three events and four flows. Again, before we, we dive into the events and flows, I'd like to show that the rule that made all this happen, this is a default rule in Curator. So if we look at the events that uh, were sent, this is the machine learning, the UBA, nice, but it's not related to this video. This is the event that was dispatched by the custom rule engine. This is the one that we that we uh, received from the XGS, that's the IPS that detected the exploitation. So how does this connect? Okay, this type of uh, uh, SQL injection was detected with the actual X4 exchange number that we had before. Well we can actually see the payload information, all the data that was received by the, from the XGS. But the important thing is that notice that the, in the vulnerabilities that are uh, ex, uh, informed about it, there are this couple of SQL injections vulnerability on, on that particular app. And in the custom rule that fired, notice that the destination vulnerable to detected exploit was fired. So Curator made the connection, okay, I have an X4 exchange number that indicates SQL injection vulnerability. Uh, I see that in that field there had been an attempt uh, from the, uh, the, the XGS, the IPS reported of, of an attempt of exploitation. Curator connects the dot and this particular rule that we saw detection, uh, destination vulnerable to detected exploit fires uh, the offense. If we look into the flows that contributed to this offense, we actually see the, those uh, four, uh, let's take this one, which seems to be the one that has the most uh, content. That C is for content that was actually uh, extracted. So let's click on it. And we can see, you know, that we, in case that you want to investigate the payload, here's all the payload information from the uh, source as well as destination, nothing escapes uh, here to Curator. And the important thing is that it also contributed to that particular rule, destination vulnerable to detected exploit. This is, by the way, this is not a new uh, feature. This has existed in Curator and AppScan for a while, but I just wanted to highlight because I think this is remarkable uh, to have that capability of my custom applications 
when vulnerabilities are found and for x y and reason let's say that you know the developers cannot fix it very quickly uh, whatever it is the the situation and and curator detects by virtue of an ips on any other endpoint telling it about the, the real threats that are being attempted to the application curator connects the dots and say well this vulnerability you better pay extra attention because it's now under exploitation